hello guys welcome to it's all about tech and my name is Mahesh and today I am showing you how you can provide or you can uh, put Mac filtration on your router and today I am going to show you on the router of D-Link 2750U so let's start first of all you have to go to Google Chrome or whatever internet browser you have just open it now my system is a little bit slow sorry for that and now you have to just type the router IP address normally it's 192.168.1.1 depends some router has uh, 192.168.0.1 so you have to check about, about that and press enter uh, here it is your login page for your router or modem you can say and user name is admin and default password is also admin but if you have changed you have to put there you change one password and I have changed my password so I'm gonna write it down yes and now I'm in the home page of my 2750U D-Link router so yeah for Mac filtration first of all I will tell you what is the Mac filtration uh, Mac filtration is if you want to provide second level of security for your internet or your wireless internet access like uh, uh, many people do uh, does what they does is uh, they just put the Wi-Fi password uh, with the security of WEP 2PSK something like that uh, they just put the security if someone tries to hack because I want to tell you guys that yes Wi-Fi password can be hacked and some people says how and I have done this uh, research on that but it took uh, people to do that around two hours depends how the guy is geek about that uh, depends on how much it, uh, the guy is uh, geek about that and uh, yeah it can be hacked using linux yeah kernel shell many of people uh, know about this shell a linux kernel mm. so yeah uh, i'm saying that uh, wi-fi password can be hacked so what you can do is you can provide a second level of or you can say uh, a security that uh, cannot you know uh, easily been detected or can changed <coughs> so with the help of Mac, Mac filtration what you can do is you can just put the Mac address of your devices whichever device you want to connect with your wireless router or Wi-Fi you can just provide the Mac address of that device to the router so whenever your router is routing the networks it only connects with the those mac address which are in which are put inside or uh, which are uh, given to the router to access so in that way even if a some even if someone knows your password you know uh, by mistake someone knows your password you have tell someone or anything else by mistake you have to do something that gets other guys to know your password so in that manner they are not able to connect to your Wi-Fi because when you enable your Mac filtration what it does it do uh, just connect to the do those devices of uh, MAC address which are stored in your router you have to provide the MAC address to the router first 
of the devices which you want to connect with the router and then you can ena enable it so no one can you know access without having that MAC filtration or uh, MAC address so uh, someone having different MAC address cannot connect to your wireless internet so how you gonna do it is first of all you are in home page of your dealing 2750u and guys I'm telling you I have uh, seen so much things about hacking because what guys think is ah my neighbor is having wireless so why should I buy it why shouldn't I go for hacking it so it's kind of thing because I me also I also think that uh, the network around me of my neighbors I try to hack them but I don't have that much knowledge of Linux so if I have that much knowledge of Linux I will definitely show you the video uh, on another anytime when I have that knowledge so what I'm saying is how you gonna do the Mac filtration you're on your home page and you have to go to advanced for 2750u dealing router and in advanced you see Mac filtering yeah hit on that yeah there is uh, three Mac address I have put my family's my uh, cell phone Mac addresses my mother my sister and mine and I have checked the enable access control mode uh, when you check that mode enable access control mode what that means is only the list of MAC address you can see there are three MAC addresses only these three MAC addresses can access your wireless internet no other person can access without that MAC address so that is one of the best you know for security purpose so no one can use your uh, Wi-Fi even if you want to fool someone that or you want to like show yeah I am a cool guy I can give you a password you can you know show them and tell oh my password is this let's try to connect so what you can do is you can show that guy by entering your uh, Wi-Fi address uh, Wi-Fi password to your cell phone and show that guy that yes mine is connected and then try with the that guy's cell phone or whatever device that guy is using and then the network is not connected with that so you can say that dude I have given you the my, my password but uh, it might be some problem with your device in that manner you play a safe role and you save your image that someone uh, what thought uh, someone what uh, think that uh, what thinks that uh, that this guy is not giving me password he is like kind of rude or something like that depends on person to person some people says ah I don't want your password some people hey guy can you give me your password uh, so in that manner that Mac filtration is very helpful for you guys so how you can do is uh, on the Mac filtration when you could click on Mac filtering you see this okay and you need to just add and MAC address and how you gonna show uh, how can you how you gonna find your MAC address uh, these days you can easily on your Android devices I am particularly uh, showing you how you can uh, find your MAC address on your Android devices okay so yes so how you can uh, how you gonna find your MAC address first of all this is my cell phone yeah first of all go to settings on your cell phone and after settings you go to about phone and after that legal information sorry sorry status sorry status and in the status you see Wi-Fi MAC address 
you have to just copy this you have to just copy this or you can write it down anywhere okay and that MAC address is your device Wi-Fi MAC address okay so yes so how you you have to just copy that MAC address and write it over here and you can apply it and after applying that MAC, MAC address is going to be added in this list or your list okay so let me do an example for you guys first of all I will gonna delete and MAC address from my list so I'm gonna delete the same cell phone device MAC address so you can you guys can see okay 3c so yeah there it is 3c 91 something like that uh, first of all I delete I have I'm going to delete this 3c9 okay and a pop-up comes are you sure want to delete this okay now it's gone from my list see now I'm gonna add that MAC address again for you guys Okay, now apply and now that MAC address will go below that list you can see that right and now you have to enable this if you disable uh, uncheck this then anyone can access your Wi-Fi with just your password they just know uh, have to know your password and they can use your wireless internet if you enable this only the MAC address will ex have the access of your internet. No one, no other one have your internet access. Then again, okay. So I have just added a MAC address for you guys, and now you have to just log out from your router after applying. Log out, and yes, I have logged out. Now you can check. On your cell phone and try with another device with with the mac address which is not available on that list hope this video helped you guys and do subscribe and like this video and thanks for watching it's all about the tech